There are no words. WTF. That was Army's now estranged wife Elizabeth's reaction to disturbing accusations made against her ex-husband. Ones leveled in public. I thought that he was going to kill me. And in the explosive docuseries, House of Hammer. He said, I'm 100% a cannibal. Elizabeth, who declined to participate in the series, is now breaking her silence in the new Elle magazine. She says she learned about his accuser's claims in real time, along with the rest of the world. You can imagine the pain Elizabeth must have felt finding out that the father of her two children was not who she thought he was. Army Hammer violently raped me for over four hours in Los Angeles. One of those accusers right there is known as Effie. She came forward in 2021. Now, two months before that bombshell, Effie reportedly replied on DM to a follower who had called Army a sick bastard, saying it was consensual and that Army, quote, is not dangerous, he didn't rape anyone. Effie has since released a series of Instagram messages allegedly from Elizabeth herself, wherein Elizabeth strongly encourages Effie to go public. At that time, Elizabeth's rep explained it to People magazine, saying Elizabeth sought to determine the veracity of those allegations. No charges were ever filed against Hammer. In the new L article, Elizabeth also opens up about her 10-year marriage to Army, saying they were in couples therapy during much of that time with famed psychotherapist Esther Perel. Relationships are changing rapidly. Elizabeth says the relationship really began to fall apart as they were in lockdown in the Cayman Islands at the beginning of the pandemic, when Army decided to leave her and their children to help a friend renovate a motel in California. Are you saying what I think you're saying? Army, who received a Golden Globe nomination for Call Me By Your Name, just gave his first interview to reporter James Kerchick from Airmail. In it, Army denied all of the allegations against him and revealed he was sexually molested by a youth pastor when he was just 13 years old, saying, quote, I was powerless in the situation. Army Hammer's done a good job of at least owning his deep imperfection, right? You asked him, are you guilty of being an emotional abuser? And he said one million percent. He committed harm, he'll admit that. But it was not physical harm and it was not criminal harm. It was as he admitted to me, it was emotional abuse. And, and he's very upfront about that and he doesn't want to be um, absolved for that. I mean, he's admitting that behavior, but he wants to be very clear that he did not commit any sort of, you know, non-consensual acts with any of these women. As for Elizabeth, she owns a successful bakery, which is looking at its fourth location, and she's dating someone new. She tells Elle she's working with Army to co-parent their children, Harper and Ford, adding, I support Army through his journey, and I always will. All I've ever wanted is for him to be sober, healthy, and happy, and he is that.